Hello guys, in this video, we will be covering a better way to get histories in PowerShell. So to get history in PowerShell, we have to run get history commandlet. It will just give you the all the executed commands in your PowerShell console. But if you want to run specific commands, either you can hit up or the down arrow key to just toggle between those commandlets or you can just try to copy and paste them in your console and run them. But I think there could be a better way to this. So I will make a function for that. I'll name, name that function h plus. We don't require any parameters here. We'll move over get history inside this function. We will try to pipe the results to outgrid view. We'll provide a title to it. I'll choose the output mode as multiple so that we can choose multiple history items. I'll then pipe it to a for each object. Wherein, first of all, I want to echo the name of the commandlet which I'm trying to execute. So I will type something like this. I'll copy this from here. I'll put some new line here. And I'll give it to invoke expression here and some more new line characters at the end okay let's compile this function first clear the screen and let's try to run this function now the moment i hit enter it will pop up a screen which is nothing but outgrid view of the commandlets which have been executed i'll like like the title suggests i'll Press Ctrl and select multiple items and hit OK. The moment I'll hit OK, you will see all the results are now populated on my screen. So guys, this is how we can create an advanced get history function. For more such videos and PowerShell tips, please subscribe to my channel. Thank you.